Well, 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 you have all returned to watch me to open some One Piece today. Honestly, it's been quite a while and I'm excited for it. It's now the end of April and it is still just an absolute nightmare to find any One Piece anywhere. Though I did get lucky with a random Walmart restock on a Sunday, which is kind of weird. I'm not complaining though. But I did manage to finally get one of the Three Brothers decks and then I believe like eight packs of Wings of the Captain. I just happened to stop at Walmart to get something. I walked by the card section, just barely seen the one piece pack standing out freaking screamed like as uh, as loud as i could and ran over and got them and since then my target restocked they got a ton of these decks sitting there it's seriously been days they're just sitting there nobody wants them for some reason i don't know maybe one piece is dead but i did pick up a second deck because i want another one of those promo packs but before we get to those let's go ahead and open up just a bunch of random packs now i get six packs of paramount war and yes i know i said i found eight packs of wings of the captain but we're only open up three today i'm saving the other five for something else you'll see it eventually but since we only got three of them let's start with wings of the captain and see if we can get lucky maybe pull a manga out of three packs it's it's doubtful but it it could happen it could happen now i've not pulled too awful much from wings of the captain i can't remember we've pulled some good stuff uh, the Perona alt art, we've got the Gecko Moria alt art, I believe, as well. We got a couple other cards that weren't too, too awfully crazy. So, anything from this set will be nice. I'll be happy with it. There's that awesome Brook Hollow. I love that card. So cool. Ooh! <laughs> we got a Hody Jones. Now, I do have this. I said I've not pulled too awful much, but oddly enough, this is one of the pulls I have gotten. But... It's, I'll take it. It's a hit. It's textury. Hopefully that's not the only pull from all of these eight packs here. Hopefully we can get something else. I, I don't know. Maybe some people that was there before me pick through packs and stuff. I don't know. Anyways, continuing on. Let's see. We've got this guy. I forget. Gaspard. We've got a bunch of people that I've forgot about because it's been so long since we've opened up One Piece. I think it's, well, it's not been that long. It's been a couple weeks. So, I've still got enough for a couple more One Piece videos before I start freaking out. Then we got Tot Musica as our first hollow, and we've got Ryuma on the end. All right, so last pack of Wings of the Captain. Let's see if we can at least get a super rare, maybe. That would be cool. That's what we want we want the shiny pools. We want the shiny pools. We want the texture pools. We want any pools we can get. Let's see. Knowing my luck, I, from what I'm guessing here, I kind of kind of see the side. I don't think we got anything. Unfortunately, but we'll see. Maybe I'm wrong. We got that cool looking artwork there. I like it's and darn it. There we go. Perona. <sighs> yep, there we go. We got a leader. There's <laughs> our pull for the pack. We got uh Van Vander Decken. Yeah, and ooh, we did get a hollow Onami though. I actually don't think I've pulled this yet, so that is we'll count that. We'll we'll count that. We count the Namis in this house. All right, now on to the Paramount War Packs. Now, I got these at Hot Topic randomly back in January or February, I believe. I didn't want to open them up on their own. I wanted to get something else. And since we've got these decks today, and since there's really not much to them besides the single promo pack, perfect time. Perfect time to open these up. And I also don't remember what is in these. Uh, I do know the Ace uh manga is in here i do believe there was a nami in here as well that looks cool that i'd like to pull we got a carrot as our first hollow don't remember you and we have got the gum gum rain on the end and then the normal 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 don card gotta it just we're shooting for one, a couple good super rares or one nice textury thing that's i mean that's that's what everybody wants is it not it is Let's see Get lucky, get one, one one really good solid pull. That's all we want. Take a take a book for, or a page from CTR's book and rustle rustle my jimmies. Let's see. We have got this big old yellow thing. Yep, don't know you. We've got Tony Tony Chopper in his film red outfit. We have got a cool looking buggy hollow. And behind it, it's it's a it's a Luffy. It's a Luffy SR. Okay not bad i'll i'll take it it's shiny nice nice super rare nice nice super rare but we want we want that's not what we're settling for though we want something a little bit 
a little bit bigger, a little, a little better. If we don't get anything from these, please, at least let's get some good stuff from the promo packs and the decks. All right. Um, yep, we got Zoro in his little captain's or pirate outfit, punk outfit, whatever you want to call it. We got Frankie Douglas Bullet. We got Takuma, uh, this person here. Yep, we got Monkey D Garp as our first hollow. And Sen Goku as our second. Three packs, three packs left. Not, not losing hope. Not losing hope. My luck with One Piece is usually really good. I've stated that. I say that in every One Piece video. But lately, it's not been too, too, too great. The the double packs that we opened up last time were a little left, a little left to be desired. So hopefully, I've got a sealed box of them still to open up. Hopefully, it's a little bit better. We got Dan Dan. We got Vista. Okay, I don't ever remember pulling you. And we've got an Ace. Super rare. All right. I don't believe I've actually pulled that before. So that that's possibly a new hit. Cool. Too too bad it wasn't the manga though. And that pack was really up there. Hopefully it didn't ooh, mess that up. We'll see. We'll find out. I don't think I did. I think we're I think we're good. We're good. All right. What do we got here? We got King Du. Uh, we got the Bay Lady with the Kumas normally. We got Gecko Moria, a Sphinx, okay. Guy with the sword, uh, Venom Road, Mr. One Das Bones. We got this cool looking. Ah, damn it. Uh, Kinemon. There we go. We got a leader, normal leader. So there's our hit for that. And then they did these. Yep. All right. Final, final pack of Paramount War. Come on. Let's we'll, we we'll, let's go. We've got this. Give us something texture textury, a uh, police please. Anything but a leader, honestly. All right, let's see. Come on, something good, something good. Three store style, Death Wink, Blue Gurry, another Gecko Moria. We got another Sphinx. Uh, we got Morley Squard. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. Moving on. All right, let's go ahead and open up one of these decks now and we'll get the promo packs out and see if we can get lucky with these. All right, now I think everything comes, yes, everything comes packaged up in the single deck box that is in this thing, which is pretty cool. I actually do like that. Deck box looks awesome. You got Luffy on the front there. You got Ace on the right, Sabo on the left. And just the One Piece logo on the back. Same thing on the top. All right, let's see what we got here. We got a big old piece of cardboard we don't need. We've got our promo pack with our three cards. And we've got our ooh, big old thick boy there. And then just a small little divider inside the deck box that has every, the three brothers on it. I mean, yeah, that's what the deck is called. All right, we'll take a look at the deck real quick. See what we got in here. Now, I don't know what's in here. I don't really follow the deck kind of things because they don't quite play yet. So, whenever I do go to play, I should have the cards to do it. So, we should be good there. All right. First up, we have got an awesome looking Sabo leader. That looks so cool and textured as well, which I love how they include those textured cards in these theme decks. We have got Ace behind it. Ooh, I like the colors of the Ace. The blue and yellow look cool. Not bad, I like it. And then of course we've got the Luffy on the end. That is such a cool looking card. All of them punches everywhere, looks neat. Digging it, digging it. And then we've got, ooh, we've got some more hollows in here as well. Are these? Oh, these are textured as well too, cool, okay. We've got Sabo character there, couple of them, two of those. We have got the Ace, which looks awesome. Very, very cool artwork two of those oh we got some monkey d garbs i like that awesome nice i like those those are some cool looking cards two of those as well and then of course you can't forget your boy luffy there there we go and two of those as well oh we've got even more textured stuff is everything in here got some no okay these are the last two textured things there very cool nice artwork on everything in there i like it then I do believe everything else in here is hollow as well. So we got some Edward Newgates, we got Dan Dan, 
A couple of them, and we've got some little Sabos there. That's cool. I like that artwork. We have got Shanks, awesome pose from you. What else we got here? We got Kid Ace. Now, since we got Kid of all of those, I'm guessing we're gonna have Kid Luffy as well. Here we go, a couple of them. There we go, Kid Monkey de Luffy, love it. Now, I'm wondering if we, ooh, we even got some Yamatos, and that is, ooh, that is some cool Yamato artwork. I like it. All right, glad I got two of these now. Ooh, and even the events on the end are, this is a different kind of hollow. This seems more, this is like the super rare hollow that you would get. It's not as dim, I guess, as the others, other hollows you get, the normal ones. There's Three Brothers Bond, which is a cool looking card. And then also all of the Don cards have like a rainbow hollowing effect to it as well. Very, very cool. I like this. Like I said, glad I got two of these. And whenever I go to play, I've got some cards to start out with. Now, like I said, I do have a second deck here to get opened. And I'm going to gut this thing for the promo pack. And then we'll get those opened. Carefully as to not knock over stacks of cards that I never pick up. Here we go. There are our two promo packs that come in the Three Brothers theme deck. Now let me get some scissors here and we will carefully open these up. Now I do believe the Luffy leader is the most expensive out of these. I think it was sitting at like 40 or $45 last time I checked. The Sabo is one of the other top three and the other one is the Ace character. I think is that, I think that's right. I thought it was weird that the Ab Sabo and the Luffy, what was it, the Luffy leaders were the most expensive ones and then the Sabo Ace was just like second. Or not Sabo. Eh? Let's just open the packs. I don't even know what I'm talking about. All right, here we go. Let's see our first promos. We've got three in each pack. Hopefully, <laughs> there we go. We've got what I believe is the most expensive out of them. We've got the Luffy leader. There we go. How freaking cool is that artwork on that? Oh, that is so nice. Awesome. I'm happy with that. Most expensive one. Luffy is down. And then we've got, ooh, the Yamato looks real good. Ooh, ooh, ooh. All right, so apparently it looks like it's just alt arts of every card that is in the deck. All right, let's see what our second one or third one here is. <laughs> it is the little Monkey D. Luffy. All right, I'm happy with that. That's a cool one. The green there is a nice touch. Here we go, pack number two. Let's see if we can get lucky again. Um, Ace, probably. Ace or Sabo, I really don't care. It is, oh, okay, we're gonna start off with the little Ace. All right, there we go, a little Ace, not bad. I'm happy with that one. It's a cool one. Now I kinda wish we would get the little Sabo just so I could have all three of them. Uh, <laughs> we're doubling up out of two promo packs. We got the little Monkey D. Luffy. It's not bad, it's a nice double. Hopefully, maybe I can train it for one of the other ones, but we'll see. And finally, on the end, we've got the Monkey D Garp, I will take that one. That one looks sweet. All of that blue like energy going around his fist and stuff, that's cool. Not not bad. Alright, I am I'm happy with these. These were these are sweet. Don't know if I could ever have that luck again to pull the best promo out of the set, the Monkey D Luffy leader. I am happy with that. The only thing is it sucks is these only come with these deck boxes, and these deck boxes are like 35 to 38 dollars a piece i bought i paid for two of them at different places the one at walmart was a little bit more expensive than the one at target was so kind of disappointed i'm probably not going to be getting any more of these unless i buy just the single promo packs off of ebay but either way it's a cool product i like that you get a promo pack with some alt arts of the cards that are in the deck in the comments below let me know if you got your hands on one of these decks and what you got in the promo packs if you got any of the other leaders or anything like that any of the good cards from them but that is all i have for you today i hope you enjoyed and i will see you all in the next one later